Hi, this is a demonstration of programmable sequential load control using Android application project. So you usually observe in industries that uh, there is a repetitive nature of work that is the machines have to work in same order for a long time to prepare those particular products or goods. We have demonstrated the same concept using an Android application here where we uh, use the Android application to control the load switching or the machine switching for industry as you can see. So for demonstration purposes we have used four loads here to uh, demonstrate as uh, industrial appliances or machines. So we are going to use the Android application to programmatically switch uh, these machines or uh, loads on or off for particular amount of time to achieve a desired purpose or work procedure. So for this purpose we use these four loads here which are connected through relays to an A05 family microcontroller here. The microcontroller is uh, in turn interfaced to an LCD screen and a Bluetooth modem. The Bluetooth modem is used to receive commands through the Android device and the LCD is used to display status, current status of the system and the entire system is powered by a 12 volt transformer here. So let's see how the system works. The system has been turned on. So now let's use the Android application to uh, connect to the system as you can see on the LCD screen it's showing uh, three options C is for setting uh, then for auto and manual so our system is now connected to the Android device so now let's uh, go to the manual mode first so this is the manual mode so it's now showing us uh, the status of all the loads since all the loads are off it's showing us uh, d1 d2 d3 d4 all is off so now let's switch on the first load similarly second load and so on you can uh, you know switch on and switch off the loads as desired manually so this is how the manual mode works similarly we can switch them off So now let's uh, try another mode. Let's uh, switch the system again. So now let's uh, try the auto mode. So now let's go to the setting mode and configure settings. If we don't configure settings, uh, it will run at a uh, you know 10 second delay. That's the default timings in auto mode for every load. So each load is going to switch after 10 seconds. That's the default one unless we go into settings and change the settings let's go to the setting mode so we are in the setting mode now so now we can uh, select the timing or uh, each of the loads in the time duration or the delay so now let's set it. So for load one, let's set it to five seconds. And next is load two. Let's set it for four seconds. Similarly, let's set the three for three seconds. And last load for two seconds. So the mode has been started here. As you can see here, time decrementing. So suppose this was a bottle making setup. First is the bottling machine, second is the packing machine, third is the labeling machine, and the last is the no, some other packing machine so if you set it this way it would run for you know particular run in that particular order for desired amount of time unless you reset it so this is how we can achieve full industrial automation using uh, this uh, system here easily controlled by android application so this is how the project works thank you